Hey everyone, thanks for watching. In today's video, I will be showing y'all how to make this mason jar organizer. You can also use this as a wall decor if you would like as well. So first up, I'm gonna show y'all everything that you will need to make it. The first thing is a fence board and I already cut it to 20 inches. They do cut wood at Lowe's. I just did it at home because I have a saw already. Next up, you need four mason jars. These little hooks to hang on the back if you do end up hanging this on a wall some wood stain I got gray and four of these little clamp things as you can see you can screw them to the size that you need around the mason jars and then you need just a foam brush if you do stain it with the wood stain now I am going to go ahead and stain it I did put a pretty thick coat on top of that so obviously you can do this custom to however you like so if you don't want it as dark then just put the layer of stain a lot lighter and you can see the wood better through it I also did the sides as well and then about 20 to 30 minutes after, you want to use an old towel or t-shirt or something to wipe off the excess stain that didn't penetrate into the wood. And then I let that dry until the next day. Now I'm just kind of laying out my jars to see about how far I want to place them. Since this is a 20 inch piece of wood, I placed them 4 inches apart. And now I flipped it around and right in the center I'm adding the hook on the back so that I can hang it up on the wall. Now I'm just pre-drilling the holes so that it's easier to drill the screws in. I forgot to show this at the beginning but you do need four screws. I also used a washer in between so that the jar was nice and secure to the wood. And now I am just drilling the four clamps into the wood that's going to hold our jars. I found it a lot easier to screw them in when they were open like this so that I can fit the drill perfectly up and down and the screw doesn't screw in sideways or anything like that. So once you're finished screwing all the clamps in, I am adding the jars. So as you can see, you just screw those right in with a screwdriver until it's as tight as possible because you don't want the jars obviously to fall out. Out. So that is it for this DIY. As you can see, it's super easy to make and it's also super affordable. All of the links to the products are listed down below as usual. Thanks so much for watching. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not already and I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye guys.